user was moved to your channel. Trying to skill. What's going on, bud? What's up? Same old shit, dude. Different day. So, how you feel about tonight's race? Going in knowing that you're one of the four fighting for the championship tonight. Mm. I feel okay with that. I think uh, I think old John's gonna be pretty hard to beat, but uh, I'm gonna give him all I got. Ten four, bud. I'm not gonna keep you up here long because we only got about a minute left in in practice before we get going qualifying. Uh, so, hope you improve on your uh, winning percentage this this season for the trucks. Uh, sitting with zero wins, but you've you've managed to put together a lot of good races. So. Look forward to seeing you tonight. I'll try to get some in-car shots of you so you can wave to everybody and all that. Yeah, yeah. Other than that, have fun, bro. I'll see you later. Info. Thanks for broadcasting it. User was moved out of your channel. Well, didn't start my stream with enough time to get to our other three drivers. Um, it actually looks like I only have two out of the three. I'm sorry, David. I'll have to. It's not working. I, I got something my stuff, so um, I apologize. So I'll have to talk to Doug over there on the iRacing side. Unfortunately, I don't like doing it that way, but that looks like the way I'm going to have to do it. So. Taking a look here, right along with Ryan Scope, aka Dirt, on his qualifying laps. Let's see if I can't get some of the other guys here in just one minute. stream somehow for me. I don't know how to get it over there to freaking uh, where I need it to be on. On the Facebook? Uh, Facebook, yeah. Alright, looks like Brian Muskell Jr. is done qualifying. We're going to try to jump in with somebody else here. Um, looking... Got a little caught off guard here, so looks like I'm actually going to miss a couple of people's qualifying times. I apologize for that. For some reason, I have lost Travis on my board. Gosh, all right, what's up? All right. 
right, for some reason, Justin, uh, on my camera selector, and I have lost um, Travis's car number. I don't see his car number anywhere, but I believe he's still on track, so I don't, I don't know what's going on with that. I have him up on mine. But he's just falling into the pits, it looks like. So, I'm going to pull uh, Travis and then John up here. 10 4. User was moved to your channel. Mr. John Jenkins, how you doing tonight, man? Uh, Alright, I'm middle of a queue run right now. Nice lap, dirt. Nice lap. All right, bud. Sorry to break in there while you were in your qualifying lap. I thought you had already laid them down. My apologies there. Uh, how's the truck right, feeling good. tonight? Appreciate it, buddy. How do you feel about tonight's race? Good luck, uh, everybody. Good job on those four wins this season. I uh, appreciate it. Uh, the truck feel like guys. feels feels good. Looks like the front tires lose a little bit of grip. Gets a little tight. Center off, but uh, shit, we can do. All right, well, man, good luck tonight. And good luck, fellas, and congratulations to, to the Final Four. Guys, go get it. Uh, Have fun. All righty, I appreciate it, Dave. Have a good one. User was moved out of your channel. User was moved to your channel. Nice lap, Dirt. Yeah, good Travis luck, guys. Smith. Uh, Travis Smith, how you doing fun? tonight, man? Good, what's going on, man? Not much. Figured I'd uh, pull you up here and... Let Mr. Walters speak to you good for luck, a minute. Uh, good, good luck, everybody, and good luck, guys. All right. And, uh, uh, Travis, how's the truck feeling tonight? Uh, it's really good. Um, it's just going to be about yeah, tire wear tonight. Let's see uh, who can save the best. Yeah, I, I think that's like who's going to be on top. Administrators, thank you for putting this all together, David. And all right. Well, it looks uh, like you have to get out in the truck. Let's um, see. So you're starting fourth. It looks like. Uh, so good and, luck, uh, and I hope this is next year. Hopefully, we'll talk to you in the night. Another, another season. Appreciate you guys. Uh, Thanks for uh, for uh, broadcasting. Um, uh, I can't wait to see how it turns out. I appreciate Hopefully, we put on a good show for you. You guys allow me to race. I'd like to come back. So I sure hope you guys. Good luck, everybody, today. I do talking. Congratulations to my competitors on making this ten four final four. User was moved out of your channel. Good right luck. there, Mr. Walters. We, uh, I was kind of... Hey, I just want to say congratulations to that. Dirt on uh, the marriage there, buddy. Good yeah, luck and uh, um, best wishes to you and yours. To talk, just talk. You know, we'll, we're kind of winging it here. I've never done this before. <laughs> yeah, appreciate I'm it, not man. not sure if you have either, so we'll kind of wing it and see what happens here. It'd be a nice gift, uh, Burf. Uh, yeah, so far uh, it's going to be a gift. Wow. Uh, the uh, win the championship there, buddy. Uh, we got... Dirt or Brian Miskell Jr. on the pole. You got PJ Popham on in second. Uh, you got John Jenkins in the seven and third. Fourth place, uh, the guy we just talked to, 95, Travis Smith. In fifth place, you got Andrew Nipow, 97. Starting six, the 99, Eric Blunt. Seventh place, the seven of Donnie Sturpitz. And if I butcher that, I apologize, Donnie. Uh, eighth place, it will be Harry. Uh, ninth will be Trent Drum. Tenth place, uh, TA. Eleventh place with the 24 of Gavin Martin. And twelfth place, uh, 22 of C Cody Terry. Uh, Thirteenth, the 69 of Craig Warman. And fourteenth, the 78 of Derek Robinson. Fifteenth, uh, be the number five of Ryan Hartwell. 16th, Joshua. Green, green, green. Oh, and they're going green. <laughs> Let's get racing here. 
Yeah, I'm not used to have this many trucks. I got a, I got a show in tonight, 19 trucks out there. Down low on the bottom right now. So I may be doing that a little bit. Um, I, I don't know, man. We'll figure it out. <laughs> That's why we're doing it, to learn. Looks like the number one truck for PJ Popham has finally passed the 33 of Ron Biscoe Jr. on the outside. John yeah, it looks like PJ and Lee both are passed. Sorry, just pull away from the door a little bit. The second truck looks strong outside there. Uh, in front of the 95 to Travis Smith. Look at that. Three. Three. Yeah. I know I like being aggressive. It's a little, I think it's a little bit early to go in 3 1. A little early. I mean, it's early. Well, I'm going to have to do it. Got one in the wall pretty hard there. I'm not sure if that was Travis or if that was. I don't think that was Travis that rubbed it. Just went a little tight and hit the wall coming out for. Yeah, I really hate I can't find this car. Camera selected. It was there earlier and then it just. Got one. Got one. Sorry about that, Brad. I have 99 with the first spin coming out of the fourth, looks like. That should have been a caution. <clears throat> yeah, it should have been. No caution out for the spin. Go ahead, Danny. I'll see you. Not sure about that one. Looks as if John Jenkins has about three tenths. Four tenths. Eight tenths back to Travis. 66 is one second back. So we got all four of our championship guys up there in the top. Uh, it's all good. It looks like PJ gets the wall coming out four, and John's going to go fast on the inside. And you got dirt. Oh, looks we'll like it might be three wide out of two. Get that uh, power down just yet. Good hard battle here. Over here and ride with uh, Brian Biscoe Jr. Looks like there's seven single file now. John Jones in second, Travis Smith in third, and Brian Biscoe Jr. in fourth. Donnie is still, I believe, in, in fifth. Yes, he is. Right, While well, you're riding with third, it looks like uh, Donnie's looking inside Travis there.
confuse me about that. had a change for the lead and I wasn't even paying attention to that. John Jenkins is the first. I'm not quite sure how he got around him, but Brian Muskell Jr. is in third now. Only about How did that happen? Let's see how that all went down. That happened uh, probably about three laps ago, I think, when PJ... PJ rubbed the walk out of four, and John just pounced on him. There we go. There's a nice in-car in shot of Brian that bottom he's, he's been down all, all race so far I, I mean all race a lot of the whole time yeah he seems like he likes that little line I mean I know all about that that's how I normally go and the nice thing is he's putting rubber down there so late in the run if he need late in the race if he needs to get down there it should be a little bit of rubber build up Lap traffic coming into play here as the leader John Jenkins goes around the 69 car. Not quite sure who got that 69. Not bad about that, brother man. Other than that, side by side for second place. PJ Poppin. Oh, he just pretty much slammed the door shut going out four there on him. Slide job! I had to do it. Yeah, but I'm like, uh, Larson, he made it stick there. He sure did. John Jenkins is opening up a little bit. About six tenths on the ground. Let's go. Get this one away. We're going to ride around with the lady for a minute. Yeah, I just want away, but we're probably doing pit stops here soon, so hopefully everything will get patched up again. Wrecking, wrecking. Alright, man, caution is out. Caution, caution, is, caution out. is out. Caution is out. Yeah, I think that might have been on me. I jumped from behind the 66 and somebody would have looked at me and we touched. Uh, unfortunately, guys, I'm not versed well enough in this OBS and broadcasting. Oh, uh, the 69. The wreck and show you what happened. Trent, I uh, thought they were going to stay down low, buddy. More times to be doing this, I'll have that under control and be able to... Yeah, I was hoping they would. Fun and excitement of our crashes. Hey, Scott, man, on the back. Check in with the leader here, see how he feels. 17 laps into this thing. Uh, before you do that, um, just the caution was uh, it looks like the 99 and the 24 made contact on the back stretch, and it looks like unfortunately I also caught like another car. Uh, I'll tell you what his the other one was here in a second. It would have been the 97 of Andrew and I Power. It looks like he's still moving, but the 24 is probably going to need a fast repair. Switch and look for the, the race off of pit road. See who comes out with the lead. All right, it looks like the 69 said he'll get, his free, he'll get the free pass, and the 86 of TA did stay up. Let's 
see the cars being serviced on pit road here. Looks like this two tracks is off. Yeah, it'll be Jenkins. Yep, Jenkins will have it. How about that? Oh, you're fine. I believe Jenkins did get Brian Muskell Jr. there. And so our leader right now is actually a guy that's, that stayed out, so... I'm still going to pull John Jenkins in since he was the leader. The 86 probably will be pitting this lap. So let's see if I'm right when he goes to pit road. Yeah, it looks like uh, Travis had extended pit stop for some reason. I uh, remember he scraped the wall earlier, probably fixing a little bit of that damage here. Let's talk with Mr. Jenkins as he rides around. Under User was caution. moved to your channel. Mr. Jenkins, seems like you got you a pretty strong truck there. You started a little further back than I'm used to seeing you, but you drove up there and passed uh, PJ to get the lead. Um, I believe you did inherit the lead now that 86 hit pit road, so how you feeling? Uh, truck feels all right. Um, yeah, it looked like PJ got in the wall off the floor, and that's what the momentum got me by him. Looks like dirt might have got by him too. All right. Well, uh, looks like looks like the bottom's not that bad if you can get the power down. Uh, you're running about the middle line. Where what do you think the lane is to be right now? Um, you know, I think you can pretty much race all over. It depends on how you run each line. It's pretty racy right now. And for a boss man, we'll let you get back and talk to your crew chief and all that stuff. Uh, check back in with you later. Alrighty, Dave. Thanks. User was moved out of your channel. And Justin, you you have full reign to talk and say whatever you want, man. Just because I'm kind of moving people around and all that uh, doesn't mean you can't speak up. You know. Uh, you're all good, man. I have no problem playing uh, the backup guy. <laughs> I, I have no idea what I'm doing as a lead guy, so we're both kind of screwed here, huh? <laughs> yeah, we'll figure it out somehow. And it's all about Travis fell back. It looks like uh, PJ fell back a little bit. He's going to be starting six on this restart. He's probably getting some of his damage fixed as well. I don't want to hold you up, buddy. I'm going to get to the high side and try to ride here. It's too early for me. It's going to be a rough night for him Careful. to get back up there, but we'll see what happens. Make sure I am live. I sure am. Oh, I done hit a button. Green flag, green flag. Alright, pass car is off. Looks like Dirk had a little bit of problem on the restart, and Jenkins is pulling away. Yeah, I hit a button and lost my camera for a second. And they're three wide on the back stretch. The 66, the 19, and the 99 was looking. He's finally pulled in back behind the 19. Yeah, for the most part. As it is for the most part. And sounds like someone spun. All right, man. Caution is out. Caution is out. There is another caution. Looks like we probably had a spinner in entering. And that'll be the 44 of Novak. So here in a second, what happened exactly? So since we're yeah, back under caution, looks like uh, Travis. The Sorry, 78, 78 put you in the bad spot. I wasn't going to take it there. Three wide, four wide, the 78. I know you didn't hear me. Run, my guy in four forward. Yeah, I was trying to uh, avoid the hey, lower guys in the area. 
if I hit the little speaker button over there on the iRacing side, that will cut off their chatter, correct? Adam, that was probably on me, buddy. I, I looked in there. I looked in there. It will cut out. it off. Where is you walking around? But that was my fault. Sorry, I couldn't hear you. So they'll, you won't okay, be around anymore. Be. But they'll probably still be That's up. No and how well, in the world did you? I can still hear him with it. How do you have that up right now? What? Their channel. How do you get that up? Uh, it just, it, it was there. Oh, that's how I can go in. I can mute them all. Haha, -ha, good job. Thank you for bringing that to my attention. Alright, I'm going to mute it all then. Um, just because I'm getting a lot of talk between them and us at the same time, so I was trying to kill that. Alright, the leader, John Jenkins, pitted. This is interesting. And it looks like Dirt, and, Dirt Donnie, Harry, uh, Eric Blunt, and PJ. Ooh, a lot of people stayed out, actually. was moved to your channel quick caution here Brian uh, we seen John Jenkins duck off the pit road you stayed out uh I think this is a good move for getting him caught back in the pack uh what's your thoughts here alright his radio must not be working right now so We'll have to check in on that and get back to him later. User was moved out of your channel. Sometimes we hit the wrong buttons, I guess. I don't know. Might want to pull his crew chief in. Yeah, we'll, we'll try that at another time. Looks like they're probably going to be getting up to one to go this when they come back around. <laughs> So what we can do in the meantime, I'll pull Mr. Smith up here for you. We'll see if we can dial him up. User was moved to your channel. You got a copy on the Travis? Yeah, I got you. Go ahead, bud. So I see the caution came out. You and uh, 44 went three wide with the 78. You any idea what happened on your end there? Yeah, I apologize to 78 and 44. I got a heck of a run. I almost made it three wide, but I backed out, and I think the 78 thought that I was going to dive bottom the corner and moved up to give me room and and uh, put the 44 in a while. I, I told him it was my fault. I apologize for it. Uh, we saw you hit the wall earlier in the race. Um, did you get all that damage fixed up? I did not use the quick repair, but... Uh, yeah, I got it down to zero now. That's definitely not the way I wanted to start championship night. Uh, so you're back in 14th right now, but we're only in lap 26, so it's got a long way to go. Uh, good luck the rest of the way. Thank you, buddy. Long way to go. Long way to go. User was moved out of your channel. Yeah, got, a, got two of the guys going over the championship on the, on the uh, front row. That's right. The 66, he kind of showed up out of nowhere. Nineteen. Rick Reiner, a.k.a. Harry. He's uh, up there in third. Green 
was kind of interesting to see with him even being out in clean air now. He's still running that little one. through the cars or the backwards. <laughs> well, we got dirt it's pulling away. We got a nice little four-way battle here for a second with the 66 to just scrape the wall. 19 on one car and the 99 who's now filling back a little bit. And the 66 is going to almost pull away here. And second and the one car PJ is looking the inside of Harry in turn one. Everybody's single foul for the most part now. And I got the 22 looking inside the one car for fourth. And then duck back in. The 97, the Andrew Nine, probably looking the inside of the 99, Eric Blunt in three and four. So the side by side coming out four. Them going by side side by side there for fifth. Oh, a little bit of contact. We got the seven is going to Jason Smith behind him. Along with twenty two with Kenny Taylor. Or sorry, number five with Brandon Hartwell. Looking to bounce on whoever gets left behind on that one. John Jenkins on the inside now of uh, the Tommy Nara's Danny, I got a wall in front of me, buddy. Looks like that is from 7th back to at least 11th. Actually, I make that 12th. And while we're watching that battle, it looks like the one, uh, the one truck around the 66 to take every second place.
I'm sure he went a lap down because he never showed up on my side, but yeah, he's back in the lead lap. He's in ninth and fighting for eighth right now. <laughs> Oh, Dirt's still in first. Uh, it looks like Jenkins is starting to catch up to him a little bit, and uh, Harry and the 6'6 uh, Donnie are having a nice little battle going on for third right now. Yeah, but we're not drunk, so that's a plus. No, I ain't drinking, but you know I'm always smoking. 95 tucks back in behind the two for Terry. And we're gonna, we're gonna go back up there with our leaders for a second. See the number one of PJ Popping closing in pretty good on him. I believe he's in within about a, a tenth or so. Two tenths. Oh, well, so he wasn't before, he is now. Excuse me. 
Oh, it looks like that one, uh, one truck's gonna be tough to be the one to beat once again. I mean, he's he closed in from probably about a second and a half up the up the dirt. And they're sure be getting close to pit stop, so he might be able to pull away. Yeah. In uh, about a thirty lap run here. Dead, but lead it to and then just right along with the thirty three. It sounds like he's going to get a little tight in the corners. So close to that wall coming off the turn two. It's a drag race down the front stretch. And looks like Dirt has had the slight advantage going on the one. He's definitely starting to make that high line work a little bit. Yeah, it would have been the 44 of, I don't know what it looks like, and looks like that'll be our second meeting up of the evening. And it looks like the 24 of the 66 have pitted as well. So I'll move one of our championship contenders, 66, back to 16th in the lap down for the moment. I've seen go down pit road, I wasn't quite sure. It looks like DJ Pop is on right now to go to pit road. Remember, the drivers do have to use the access road here. Right down pit road, they have to use that that access road and stay off the grass as they're getting down there. I'm sure that's, that's going to be a challenge for a lot of them today. Yeah, it looks like uh, with PJ got Harry in the 19 and the 97 also, and the 78 also pitting that lap. 99 pitting in. Brian Musco getting the ducks down pit road this time by John Jenkins. As soon as the lead. I believe that will bring Travis Smith up to third place. As I go back to watching. The leader again. I cannot tell if the yes, the 95 stayed on the track. 86 pit. Yeah, trucks have pitted that time at 33 to 22, the 99 and the 12. I think it all depends on when a caution comes out too. If the caution comes out now, it'll help them out a lot. So put all those guys lap down. And they'll have to come around and be on older tires. Um, if it stays green, yeah, it'll probably end up hurting them.
And if I had to guess, 95 would probably, I'll go maybe I'll be ducked down this time. Yeah, because it looks like the one just unlocked. <laughs> Looks like that 95 is just now ducked off on the pit road. We'll keep an eye on him while he's on the pit road. Uh, compared to the, the one, the one has managed to get in front of the 33 car of Brian Muscogee. Jr. Uh, through hitting one lap earlier. We'll see how all that shakes out here. Yeah, that the last two cars paid this lap, so next time by. And one car being first, and it looks like as it sits right now, he's got about a two second lead. And I said correctly, it'll be a 1.3 second lead. is just now coming off the pit road as you can see and he is that is a big 45 pit now supposed to, supposed to have to Green flag cycle John Jenkins managed to close in a little bit on the 33. Justin, I'm not quite sure what the gap number was, but as far as on track, he does look like he's a little bit closer. Yeah, he's about a second and a half behind uh, that right now, but he's got a lap car between them, so that's going to hurt a little bit too. trucks and there's quite a couple little groups here. I don't know which ones to watch. I hate uh, I hate watching the race on TV when they don't show the leaders the majority of the time, but some of the better racing or closer racing looks like it's back there's just a little bit past the number seven. Go ahead, Brent. Scroll on through the field. I don't know why I hold my button. Thanks, bud. The time. No problem. Yeah, you're right about that. There's a nice little battle here with the the 95 and the three and the 12. Looking behind, not too far behind. I'm here for it was like seventh through ninth.
Yeah, it looks. I mean, Dirt's. I mean, only fallen back. I think about two tenths since they've took the leader back over. And the sevens. I mean, barely getting any ground on them. So it looks like Jenkins up to about five tenths behind him now. Nice little battle frack here for sixth place between the 95 and the 66. It looks like the 95 is going to take it here coming in the turn one and two, though. All right, along with the 22 here. Oh, he's currently in fifth. So we're going to switch back to ninth place, battle for ninth place. The 99 is looking the inside of the three, and looks like he's going to pull it off coming out of two. So we'll move back up to up back up to fifth place. Place brought up now. I got the 95 that's caught the 22. Let's see how much how much uh, patience he has here. And 
And 33 hits the wall out of two. And the seven's going to go bottom, looks like. I don't want to waste a whole lot of time meeting that around later. Later it's coming. And the next round of pit stops to start. The number one TJ starting pit lane. Give seven the lead for the time being. I think we have to fit again. I'm sitting there looking. They're doing about 30 laps. I don't know how far they can stretch it. But I think I saw one stretch 34, but that was with caution laps. Um, I would say comfortably try to go to 84 to see how you can make it. Um, right now on 76, and like John's on lap 22 of his run. Travis on lap 20. Those guys would probably be good to go to the fuel run and make it the rest of the way. I don't know if PJ's plan is the short pit and get tires and make it the rest of the way. But every time you get up and leave you, as you're going by. One on the grass, this looks to 78. Good job driving, Gavin. Alright, man, caution is out. Caution is out, but that's gonna hurt quite a few. Ship contenders, it looks like at least two of them are gonna be caught out here. Can't really tell on my relative screen right now. Oh, I was wrong. It wasn't the 78 spun out. It was a 22. Cody uh, Terrett spun out. Coming out for. Actually, that looks like the only person that's going to be caught out by that. He's probably going to be. Uh, out there too, so that's not going to hurt any of them. That's definitely. Yeah, Travis, I'm wasn't trying to race your hard. So I'm just letting you do your thing. That's who I was getting confused with our championship contenders. No, you're fine, dude. I just that was good heads up right there on your part not to wipe us both out or all three of us out. Coming on the pit road here. 
And now it's gonna be some, now it's gonna just be someone gonna come down, take the chance and top off with one to go, and make it the rest of the way, or they're gonna try to stretch it those last couple laps. And everybody it was on lead lap came down. And it's gonna be the 33 off pit load and seven, and the 19, and the 95, and 12 around the top five. Let's see if we can get the crew chief this time of that 33 for you, Mr. Walters. You're racing there, Travis. Sorry, I scared the shit out of you. User was moved to your nah, it was good, man. I, I liked it. Alright, yeah, I got no damage. Pretty cheap for the uh, wall and I was 33. I have no damage. How's the truck feeling for dirt? I was doing pretty good for him. He uh, got in a wall yeah, a little bit, like but it wasn't any damage. I thought you saved it about five right times. Though. Just biding our time and hoping nothing happens. I did save it about five times. This is that last one got me. So now we're going to pretty much be on right the edge the of the fuel of run. Do you think you can make yeah, it to the end? Real bad. I doubt it. I think just about everybody's going to have to pit at least one more time for fuel. I'm having the same problem in one and two. Now I know you guys didn't have the best truck, but it looks like yeah, one and two. I'm, I do put really the, good at one and two. One truck at this event, like after now you guys feel your chance are going to be the course for you to win though. Let's. It's pretty decent uh, right now. Um, he's going to have to work through traffic on old tires, so he's not going to be great for this little bit. But I'm after that, we'll be back there to you. But I got to go over and talk to him, guys. Alright, how are you for joining us? No worries. Well, I'm on my lead lap still. I'm only in 12. I'll, I'll make it there. It took me... It took me 82 laps to get back to where I started at. But yeah, I started 13th and I'm in my way to 4th. So I mean, it's, I mean, it's well, well. pretty good. Mr. Smith, it's been a long race for you. Looks like you got yourself back up there where you at least have a shot here to contend for this championship. Uh, looks like you got three out of you four up there right now. What do you think your chances are on this restart? Uh, 31, 32 laps to go. It's anybody's race, but y'all got the best seat in the house. 10 4, we'll let you know we get rid of this one. 10 4, thank you. The user was moved out of your channel. Uh, I do have to say, I'm going to disagree with uh, the Roy there. I think Travis will be able to make it on fuel. I got a passing under yellow for some reason. It's, it's going to be a good one. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to sit down and see how much he's got going to save here. Or if they're going to go green balls to the wall. Nineteen's able to make that pass on the seven on the inside. <coughs> Once again, our, our four championship contenders are all within the top. I'd say six right now. 
top. I guess that is Ninety five with a big move on the seven. Like Brian Muskell Jr. has opened the back. Hey, PA, you're all over the place, man. You're in and out. There you go. You're back. You're back. Second. Yeah, you're good now. Seven tenths. kind of maintaining the same cap. Seven into the wall just a little bit there. And I just brushed it enough to make sure it's there. Four sitting there playing cat and mouse looks like from fifth on back to tenth or getting a nice little gaggle getting ready to start a balance position here. Yeah. 
Thank you, Bowen. No problem. I mean, you, you track me back down, I'll return to fight with Bowen. Looks like Travis is falling back a little bit. Probably, sit, probably doing some fuel saving. to a fuel thing here, buddy. Yes, sir. <coughs> uh, they're trying to wreck up here. Can they throw some room, guys? Uh, those look pretty sick. So we were talking about the strategy earlier. I was just listening to Travis. He's definitely clutching it and saving, trying to see how much he has possible here. We got 14 left, 15 left to go. Maybe 14th one. Easy. I'll put his fuel. I'll put him. Yo, 20 fuel. What the fuck, man? I swear to God, y'all. Oh my God. Come on, guys. All right, man. Caution it down. Caution it down. There's a strategy. That's just crazy, dude. Racing for 13th through 20th? Come on. I can imagine. See a wild. 
I think a wild guess that Fox not happy about that either. Check it up on the back, stretch. And watching the replay, it looks like the 22 got into him a little bit, got into the 3, and then tapped him a second time in the middle of 3 and 4, and just spun him around. Now the question is going to be who's going to take two tires? Unbelievable. Let's try to stay out. Looks like the 95 is going to stay out. And he's got about three or four other guys with him. I might help him, help him with his chances here. Oh, the 69 took two, and I almost beat the 33 out. I guess I was wrong with the 95, unless it's someone else. It looks like him, because I saw him come out. And the 69 went back in again. Excuse me. Well, Justin, I'm talking about just a little here. 11 laps to go. It looks like the 33 is in a good position to, to not only win tonight's race, but first win of the season this year in the trucks for him. This will actually make his second championship ever uh, when it comes to racing uh, online, whether it be on the console side or, or the, the iRacing simulator. Um, he just won his first championship a couple months ago with our Cup Series here, Next Gen Racing. Uh, how happy do you think he's going to end up being if he can manage to pull off the win, win the championship, and get his second championship. Almost, almost back to back with the, the Cup Series. If you would, you know what I mean, as far as the back to back. I think it'll be a stack, and I think he's got a good chance to do it. I mean, he's he's first. I mean, he got another championship guy right behind him in third. Actually, the other three are third, fourth, and fifth. So, I mean, he'll probably pull it off, but it'll be a good last, uh, last nine laps. I want to give a big shout out to the race team. to green, 10 to go here. Um, all those championship guys are going to be on their toes. Looks like we got the 66 lined up in the third, the 95. Ten laps and three contenders up toward the front. This is going to be interesting. All four of them up there in the top five. Uh, for all the marvels, man, you can check the records, baby. What do you think about it? Oh, yeah, that's going to be fun. I, I have a feeling it's going to go three or four wide here going into one. All right, I'm probably not going to hit my, my button over here. I'm probably just going to call what I view. Uh, but, with just the regular Take it to the house, dirt. Do your thing here, I'll do mine. I'll work this up. It's in four. All right, your pace call. Oh, Ten to go here. Brian Skill Jr. Green flag, green flag. He's five. off. 19 with a slow start to 66. Brian Skill Jr. One and a half.
half I'll tell you, Brian, did your Smith comes down and secures that fourth place spot. We run off the two, Brian Scott still. Sixty-six of them has got to get by the nineteen if he wants to have any shot at not only winning this race but winning the championship. As it stands right now, if you're going to win this championship, you're going to have to win the race. And the guy out there believing right now, he's been up there all night long. I think it's going to be hard to, to get up there and pass him. Giving them all types of Third place car is about eight tenths off of 95 of Travis Smith. That's all on me, Harry. Sorry about that, bud. It, it, it sounds like the way he chattered the 99 has got good, bro. Second, third, fourth, and fifth, all on top of each other. As Brian Miskell Jr. stretches his lead out to eight tenths of a second over second place, 95. And that second to fifth is is going to be changing. Too deep back there. That's got to be it. Seeing them, all them guys battle. Got a hard play. Travis Smith and those guys. See, he's got a pretty good spot as well. Five to go. Your lead is still. I see you, Brandon. Go ahead. to go. Your lead is still seven tenths over the 95. Travis Smith, 1.2 seconds back to Cody Terry, 1.4 back to John Jenkins. Way to go, Dirt. One more, one more. You got a gap. Three, three call like that. This win as well. Coming to the white flag right now. Eight tenths of a second over second place is the 33. Brian Scale Jr. fanning out on the front stretch behind him. This. this is uh -huh. 33 coming around turn four for the final time. Not quite sure how many he led, but you're winner. Jump out, dirt. Way to go get it, baby. 
also takes the championship for the great job Derek Next way to go well that was a battle I don't know how I ended up taking team. everything I went through not a good job Derek congratulations good job Derek good racing guys Congrats, Derek. Yeah, buddy. Great season. Justin, that was Thank you, Jordan, guys. Donnie and George running with you this year, too, buddy. Yeah, bud. Thank you for all your help this year. Getting me after that my lucky season. He pulled really away. It. He deserves that win. But that battle for third there, then, was a beauty to watch. Uh, the 7 and the 22 are beating and banging for third. Oh, man, I think I had you. On the fuel strategy, but anyway. Job, Dirt. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Appreciate that. Good race, guys. Uh, you got it. Yeah, I still got your fuel strategy was looking like it might be coming into play. How about you, Roy? How do you feel about getting your second championship? Oh, that's awesome. That late caution was... Good race, you guys. I hope you all bring us back on next, that uh, next season. A lot of fun. We, we were going to short it. It'll be a part of it. And I saw how, how hard they were racing behind him, and then I started keeping him out for a little bit longer, and it worked out, worked out best. All right, well, we're going to let you go... Uh, Give Brian a shout to him. Chad for yeah, he should be in my room or the spotter room I was in. He may have it muted. User was moved out of your channel. If as uh, if you want to, I'd say bring uh, third place guy in. If he's up there. Uh, hold on one second. Who was third? Cody? Uh, Cody Terry. User was moved to your channel. All right, guys, we got the third place finisher here, Cody Terry, with us. Uh, that was a nice little battle between you and uh, the seven there for the uh, third place. Yeah, yeah, it was. That was a heck of a battle. I uh, I would like to say an apology to Brandon. I did not mean to get him to that hard. That was just completely my fault. And I uh, hope he could forgive me later on. But uh, it was a heck of a battle. Uh, it was it would have turned out a little differently, but it is what it is. And we were watching along there when uh, dirt pulled away. And it was nice to see some rubbing that uh, didn't end up in a caution. Yeah, me and, um, who was it, uh, Jeffrey Jenkins, uh, yeah, me and him had a heck of a battle there at the end, and, uh, really appreciate him racing clean, got a little bumping, I about got loose and got turned, but I saved it, and it was hard racing, that's all it is. Alright, is there anybody you want to thank? I'd like to thank my sponsor, GBC, Groundbound Calls, uh, and the Spencer Boyd LLC, it's good to have them with me, uh. Good friends of mine. And, uh, glad they like to sponsor my ride. All right, Cody. Uh, once again, congratulations on third place finish, and hope to see you next season. I can't wait to see you there. User was moved out of your channel. All right, I guess next will be Travis. user was moved to your channel. Alright, Travis. Well, we know you're trying to do the fuel strategy there, and I thought you were going to pull it off. I had that late caution. Still finished second. Not bad. Um, how'd you feel about tonight? Uh, it was up and down night for sure, but yeah, I think I had him on the fuel strategy. I was two laps to the, or actually right on the numbers, and then I got two laps to the good on it. And was just riding there. I think we'd have been alright, but I don't know how we got back to second, but I'll take it. Yeah, I was watching there at the end uh, after Dirt pulled away from you guys. That was a nice move to get second and start pulling away. That was a heck of a four-way battle there for a little bit. 
Yeah, I beat him a tenth every other lap and then equaled him. If I could have knocked those tenths down every lap, I kept on missing my marks. I would have, might have been to the bumper, if not about a car length back on the last lap and had a shot at it. But he done an awesome job. Congratulate Dirt. Congratulations on his big week he had. And on the championship tonight, it was a lot of fun racing with him this year. Uh, is there anyone you want to thank before we uh, kick you out and bring you out of dirt in? No, nah, just thanks to all you guys. Awesome series. Awesome job putting it on every week. And can't wait to get back and watch you, see how you and Dave done. All right, thank you. Uh, congratulations again on second place. And can't wait for next thanks, season. Sir. User was moved out of your channel. User we definitely moved to your channel. I broke in on a little bit of conversation there. <laughs> My <laughs> man. Race winner. What's going on, bud? What's up, buddy? Well, winner of the race, winner of the championship. Got your second championship within, what, two months now? Hell of a job tonight, man. You drove your, your butt off. Uh, yeah, tell us what you had out there. Had one hell of a fast car for 15 laps, and then, <laughs> then it kind of fell off on me. Started getting loose, but uh, cautions fell right, and, and right there at the end, Roy made the right call to, to keep me out because we were going to short pit that last, that last one. And uh, he kept me out because of what was going on behind me. And uh, that was the winning race call. Oh, oh, Travis, definitely a little worried about him there at the end. <laughs> <sighs> that was fun. John made a, made a couple wrong calls, I believe, early, which set him back. But I'll take it. We led a lot of laps tonight, and come home with the victory all right bud before i have uh you thank anybody you want to thank or anything out there uh i'm gonna bring somebody else up in here that that means a lot to not only uh you racing uh one of your biggest fans that i know of you know exactly who i'm talking about um does a lot for the series and the league behind the scenes and i'm glad we found her and, and she's ours so uh I'm going to bring Jags up here. User uh, was Jags is your probably going to want to kill me for bringing her up here. But uh, Jags, there you go. Your, your main man's second championship in almost two months. Won the race. Awesome. He, he's good. What channel. can I say? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that he is. I'm glad he's finally finally clicking on all cylinders and everything. Uh, championship was a long time coming. Should have had one way before now. Now he's got two. Uh, gonna have to keep an eye on him, but uh, figured I'd bring you up here. So the the Dirt Roy combination is awesome. It's just incredible. Well, Dirt, anybody you want to thank, uh, say sponsors, any of that? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'll well, thank you first off for broadcasting this one. That was a damn. We did good there. And secondly, my boy, fucking Roy, I, it it's crazy how the difference is for me to be able to just drive that damn thing and and bitch at Roy when I got something to bitch about. <laughs> and uh, of course, Jags for watching and being a part of what we do. It's incredible. I guess I'll let let all y'all go back to the room. Roy, uh, good job tonight, man. Uh, you and Dirt both deserve it. Appreciate it, man. User was moved out of your channel. User was moved out of your channel. User was moved out of your channel. Well, Justin, this is going to be interesting to <laughs> replay and listen to and everything. I appreciate you coming in here and teaching me how to do this OBS shit and all that stuff, man. Uh, 
I'm sure it's going to be funny. I'm sure uh, we can do it a couple more times and get some shit ironed out. Man, I appreciate you this season too, dude. Oh, well, like I said, it's, it's fun. I mean, the only way to learn for us to sit here and screw it up. I'm hoping the guys that are watching or are watching the replay, that they, uh, they get enjoyment out of this and laugh. And if they have any feedback they want to give us or tips, we're more than welcome to listen to it. All right. Well, anybody that was watching, appreciate you watching. I'm going to end this thing now.